my name is Jay Nadell, professor of medicine and physiology and radiology at the University of California in San Francisco, and I, a, a, a position that I've held since the mid-1960s. So we published the first edition of the textbook of respiratory diseases in 1988 and subsequently five further editions of the textbook have been extraordinarily successful mainly because of the idea of documenting, fully documenting all of the information um, and the idea of relating basic science principles to the practice of pulmonary medicine. Now over this period of time, not only has pulmonology matured, but life has changed and communications um, have exploded. And um, we of the ancient world have to catch up with the modern world and our textbook has, has to be sure to be in the forefront of what's actually happening. And, and it's very exciting. We have new editors. Um, I'm personally very pleased with the choices that we've made because they're outstanding people who understand the future the technology that's required. The students have new ways of obtaining information, not always from textbooks. And many of the contributions to the, to the, temp, the contemporary texts are innovations like videos and uh, variety of other um, changes. A lot of them are electronic and these uh, I think will contribute to the future of pulmonology. So lung disease evolved mainly from the time of antibiotics, say around the maybe 40s and 50s to the study of the function of the lungs, so-called physiology. And then as the physiology was, was, became more obvious, there was a realization that the lungs contributed a, a made a novel contribution because of the impact of lungs and the battle that the lungs have with the environment. So most of the things from the atmosphere that enter the body enter through the lungs. And that, therefore I realized that the surface of the lungs were going to play a very important place in the protection uh, the defenses of the body. And so this battle between the atmospheric invaders and the lung protectors, defenses, has played an important role and will play an immensely important role in the evolution of mechanisms of disease.